considered to be the most haunted house in America, the Myrtles Plantation bears the weight of an incredibly grim past. There are a lot of stories about that era. So many murders have took place here, and this was years and years ago. The faces of two small children were locked in here. Dude, I'm not even close. I am. So it's a female, and she's right there. Now, if you stay in your own room half the night, you've done well. So that's good. Oh, ah. boy. Whoa. What, did you find something? Then look at that. What is that? Yeah, that will work. Oh, Rolling off. What's up everyone and welcome back to the Overnight Channel, a channel completely wow. dedicated to everything that lives in the night. Not Paranormal, the Area 51, aliens, supernatural, werewolves, Bigfoot, any mystery, any abnormal thing. Chupacabra? Yeah. Chupacabra. What happens to all those things in the daytime? Nothing. They just don't exist. They, no, yeah. They we don't, don't, we don't care about it. If they exist in the daytime, I don't want to know. Did yeah, a chupacabra exactly. hit you in the eye right there? Uh, no, I have allergies. Oh, sorry, my bad. <laughs> so my eye is completely swollen. We were in New Orleans yesterday working with a voodoo priestess. Yes. And of course, we had to make the drive up to Myrtle's plantation. Yes. Considered to be the most haunted house in America and home to one of the most haunted items in the world, the Myrtle's Plantation bears the weight of an incredibly grim past. General David Bradford built the Myrtles in 1796, where he lived alone for several years due to his role in the Pennsylvania Whiskey Rebellion, until finally receiving a pardon from President Adams. After the death of many residents, inheritance battles, and changes of ownership, the Myrtles managed to survive. Even through the incredibly destructive American Civil War, the Myrtles stood strong. Strangely, in 2014, a massive fire broke out at the property, causing substantial damage. The flames began just 10 feet from the main house, yet somehow not a single part of the original home was harmed, as if something is keeping the Myrtles alive and well. With reports of over 10 murders and rumored to be built upon an ancient Indian burial ground, there is no wondering why the Myrtles is home to at least 12 known ghosts, one of which is the infamous Chloe. Stories dating as far back as the 19th century with extreme paranormal occurrences documented as of the 1950s, Myrtles was not given the title of the most haunted house. It was earned. Numerous photos taken during the evening and daylight present vivid apparitions, footsteps, inexplicable touches, whispers, and clear voices have all been documented within the Myrtles. Of course, the legends of the haunted mirror and the tales of Chloe are the reason we are sleeping here tonight. Tonight begins the first true paranormal investigation on the Overnight Channel, where we put everything we have learned over the past year to the test. So make sure to subscribe, because every week we only get better and better as our journey to document proof of the paranormal continues. Over here. No, no, no. check-ins over there, Miss Hester's over there. No, I see hella orbs. <laughs> Furthest one from it has to sleep in the most haunted room by themselves tonight. Oh, perfect! Deal. Go first, go first. No, go you first. go first. Okay, fine, I'll go, go first. Oh! Oh, it's too far. Oh! Wow. Shoot. That is way too far. You're kind of close. Okay, okay, no. I didn't, no. I didn't calculate the slope. Okay, not All bad. Right. Yep. Well, Corey? Should I go? I was going to do rock, paper, scissors, but go. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I'll go. Okay. Really That's close. pretty close. We made a triangle. Yeah. Ooh. I think I wow. Got it. I think okay, I got it. the closest. I got that all day. Wait a second. Yeah, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Five. Six. Six. Damn, yeah. tie, tie there. I don't know. When's, When's your birthday? birthday? Uh, July 6th. So not today? No. Evan. I Did Evan, is it Evan's birthday today? Yeah. I think so, yeah. Oh. Birthday boy gets his own room. That's fine. That's is only it? fair. Yeah. You don't even need to like blow out your own candles. The ghost will do it for you. <laughs> Just he'll make your wish for you. Yeah. Honestly. All right, so that's settled. Quick. Yeah, cool. Yeah. All right, well, let's go meet Hester. Sorry, Evan. This is the most pleasant haunted place we have ever been. Hello. 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 How are you? 
This is absolutely Welcome to the Myrtle. Thank, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having this us. This place is gorgeous. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Uh-huh. We're lucky to have you. <laughs> <laughs> You're mighty handsome. I may hold your hand for a while. Oh, hey, wow. Wow. Hey, hey, I'm hey, Corbin. Sweetheart. Nice hey. to meet you. Thank you. Wow. Are you comfy here? You feel good? I feel good right now. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Yeah. You going to spend the night? Yeah, but I mean, we haven't um, seen the inside, so I might be speaking too soon. No, everything is good. Okay. I mean, the, the spirit, we do have spirits, you know. You know, we're haunted. All good ones, though? Well, some are a little mischievous sometimes, but they wouldn't hurt you for anything. They've, they've been here a while, so, you know, you're the one that's in their territory. Exactly, yeah. Yeah, so they may want to show themselves. The children are very playful, you know, but all is well. And in the morning, we'll see if you still have that smile. <laughs> wow. She just slid that right in there. Wow. Oh, man. You all look good buddies. Yeah. yeah. Kind yeah. of. A little bit. We yeah. tolerate yeah. each other well sometimes. If we, if we need to sacrifice anyone, though, it's him. Yeah. Uh, so. Oh, don't do it. No, no, oh, Evan. No, the camera. Yeah, not me. Not me. Oh, my God. Why, honey? It's his birthday. <laughs> it's his birthday. It's his have birthday. you been bad? No, no, Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> we heard you have uh, some of the most haunted items here. Oh, right here. our mirror, yeah. yeah. There are a lot of stories about that mirror. And a lot of people see things in that mirror. Uh, a lot of times it's once your pictures are, you know, once you look through your photographs and you realize, hey, what is this? What? Or better yet, who is this? You know, that happens quite a bit. You're well, curious, you. aren't you? Um, yes, I am very curious until it gets to me being scared. So, so many times, baby, I have really overreacted. Sometimes, and I've been here for years. But you know, it, you, some things you just can't explain. Footsteps and no one there, you expect someone to be there. Yeah, of course. When they're heavy boots and whatever, and they're behind you, you're moving a little fast, and even fast for my age, you know, it, it worries you. Because when you stop, they stop. It's as if they know what's going on. Really? Know? But let's go on the house lunch. Y'all yeah. ready? Wow. Uh -huh. Walked into heaven. Oh, we are so happy to be the summer. So honored right now. <laughs> First of all, you, you see, and this glass has been changed quite a few times, and each time it's been replaced, the same discolorations will reappear huh. in the mirror. And the first thing I notice are, are the drippings yeah. coming down the center of the mirror. And a lot of people take pictures of this, and those drippings a lot of times will appear red, as if they're blood drippings. Now on this side, you see the little fingerprints, love? Look at me, yeah. baby. I'll see those little fingerprints in there. Yeah. Huh. And at the very top, coming down, the faces of two small children will often appear. And so many murders have took place here. And this was years and years ago. So it's not like, you know, somebody was murdered yesterday. Yeah. It could happen. Yeah, tonight might be the night. What do you <laughs> oh, no. wow. Happy birthday. birthday. that the judge took on a mistress who was one of his house servants. She was caught listening in on some of their family business and eavesdropping was just not allowed. As punishment, he cut off her left ear. What? Of course, it left her upset. And a few days later, the story goes that she baked the birthday cake for his oldest daughter. She used the juices from the popular oleander. And we have a piece of oleander over there. It's all over the grounds. But it lets off a liquid very similar to arsenic. It was baked in the family's cake. It killed the judge's wife, Sarah, and two of her children. So there are three of the spirits, along with Chloe, the slave, who live here, along with Judge Woodruff's his wife. Now this is a little piece of oleander. Uh, it's what Chloe uh, served in the birthday cake. We're going to go into the French bedroom during this beautiful room. They believed that spirits would come into a room during the day. And if the room was not protected, they would stay and show themselves at night. They would hide during the day and come out at night. Put so something religious in. He thought it would protect the room. So he put angels at the bottom of his wife's chandelier, hmm. at the top of the plaster freeze work. You see those oh, four yeah. ladies' faces? Oh, wow. oh, yeah. They're said to be faces of nuns. So they were to guard the top corners of her room. He said a gentleman stood at this door, which is gonna be facing your bed, whoever is staying there. Of course, on the other side, he, <clears throat> Oh, happy birthday to you again. <laughs> <laughs> he said a man appeared. He said the man came, which would he would have come through this way. He came through the door, and when he got there, he had one arm in front of him, one hand behind him. 
He said, uh, the man greeted him. He said, good evening. He did disappear, but he nodded all the way out and he came, went back through the door, came back to this side. He said when his wife came out, he was already packing and she knew what was going on. Oof. So they left and people often still see the butler. So you may get a chance to see him tonight. Wow, look at this. I think this is my favorite room. Yeah. This is my favorite room because of the food. Nobody came to you. Yes. <laughs> I don't eat the cake. It's not real? This Wait. is, that Oh can't. no, it's not though. It looks so real. Oh, I know, I know. It's, it's not though. Oh really, it was like, oh, they have food ready for us? Like, why'd we even go get food on the way here? That looks so good. I think good. you should think about it anyway. Yeah, it does look good, doesn't it? Go ahead, take a bite. That's what happened to those three kids. Yes, they ate the birthday cake. In fact, they ate it in this room. I am told that a little girl in a plaid dress shows up quite a bit. And a lot of times she's very bossy. Hmm. She's telling people to shut up, be quiet. And she's talking to our guests. And the present owner took this picture and it was no one on the grounds and she wanted it that way. It was for insurance reasons. So they wanted no one in the photograph. But right here where the little breezeway is, look at her. And we believe it's Chloe. Wow. You can see, you can even see the boards through her. Huh. It's measured off to be human measurements and measurements of a lady, and it looks like two little children on the roof wow. here. Wow, that is pretty crazy. Well, look, That's I've enjoyed really being with you guys. Yeah, thank you so much. And, uh, well, thank you all for coming, and y'all be good. It sounds like it's just going to be like five brothers tonight. Yep. Yeah. And uh, I have a son's birthday that's tomorrow. Which one? It's this one, right? Which yep. birthday boy? Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. Hey, what's your name again, baby? Evan. Kevin? Evan. Evan, how sweet! Oh, I love that! Oh, don't build him up too much. Yes, yes! Oh, well, my it. father was named Evans. They called oh. him Jim. I have a brother named Evans, so it's a family thing. Happy mm. birthday to you! Oh, yeah, you. yeah! Well, look, y'all have a very good night. And you try to be good, okay? I, I, I'm going to be the best <laughs> out of all these people. Are you? Which one do you think of us is going to be the most attractive to, or attractive to spirits, do you think? Oh, oh I, wow. I think that one. I really do. I really do. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. She didn't think about it. She knew. Yeah. Why? Yeah. He's, he hasn't even really spoken that much. Why? I, I don't know. It's just I just have that feeling. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And I'm no psych. I'm not by, not by any means. Yeah. But I think you'll be the one. Yeah. You're gonna all end up in one room tonight. Oh, I believe so? that. Yeah. I, I yeah. That. Why, why, why do you think so? I, it's gonna happen. It happens. It happens very often. Now, if you stay in your own room half the night, you've done well. So that's good. Oh boy. That's a mama's oh, point. Oh wow. That's mom. Thank you They love us. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Right. Bye bye you. babies. Thank you and happy much. birthday Evans. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> by the way, if you don't know, our overnight channel is still doing the overnight contest where we pick one winner every single month and we fly out to your hometown and bring you to do an investigation, something fun, whatever it is that you want to do in your area. There's two ways to enter. One super simple. Just leave a like and a comment on this video. Each video you do that on equals one entry. Other ways to head over to sendsociety.com.com, the clothing line that we run for every dollar you spend also equals one entry. Every month there's a new winner. Every month it restarts. So if you happen to live in the New Orleans, Baton Rouge area, well, we can bring you back to the Myrtles or whatever it is. But we already have two videos coming up with our contest winners at the Lizzie Borden House and Bobby Mackey's. Get ready for the Myrtles vacation. Get ready. How tall is your keyboard? Seven two. How high up can your keyboard get? Keep going. Seven four. Seven four. Yep. Yep. Uh huh. There's a step behind you, actually, if you wanna. Oh. Thriller. Ah, ah, ah. The main part of the house that we're in, we only have a limited amount of time because there are actually paying guests that are <laughs> staying in the rooms above us. Yeah. So for noise reasons, we know that we can't do this quietly. Mm. So we have about an hour and a half for this part of the house down here. Our rooms are in a different part of the property and the butler's room that Evan's sleeping in. Hey. So we're gonna maximize our time down here, including the room with the mirror and the room opposite to that as well. So Darn it. every tool that we have is laid out here. And if for some reason you're brand new to our channel and you don't know what these are, this is the K2. It's one of the most trusted and well-known paranormal investigation tools. Literally just meant to measure electromagnetic energy. Yep. That is exactly what it's it my does. Favorite one. So essentially the theory is that spirits have energy and if there's spikes for no reason, that is the reason. Mm -hmm. We have a REM pod, which is entirely based off of motion. We'll have an antenna here, we'll turn it on. If anything comes near it, you have to literally get within a foot step of it for this thing to go off. Brandon, would you care to? demonstrate our tool. 
So the only reason that thing should ever go off is if you are, or someone is, or something is, within that distance of it. Whoa. And of course we have Corey's favorite tool, the dowsing rod, so these yes, will be sir. here as well. This is brand new to us. It's a motion sensor music box. So once you set it up, if anything passes within 10 feet of it, it will automatically play the music box. More so meant for child spirits. Mm -hmm. Also very scary. Very, very, very scary. Creepy. Very yeah. creepy. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Are you done? Okay. So we're done, right? Dude. <laughs> All the hairs oh my on God. my arms are standing up so much right now. Dude. Oh my God. Dude. Look at this. Look at this. Those aren't goose bumps, those are goose mountain. Is nobody like <laughs> nobody watching this right now? Could you touch that again? To make it beep? No one no one go in front of this? Because if they both go off again, both of these devices going off, it's gonna play. Okay. So that's normal, it's just detecting the room. We didn't even start the investigation. Okay, so now if it goes off. Yeah. That was one, two, three, right? Wait, what happened? What happened? Was what? that one, two, three? What? I heard that too. Tell me, too, like tell me 100 there. percent 100 percent that what was happened. Okay, our last tool. Cat balls. What? Only go off with motion. It's pretty yeah. amazing. For Stop example. Dude. So let's just chill like this. Let's chill. Like, like you have to move them pretty hard. Why does that keep stopping? Dude, what? it was not you guys stepping. I'm gonna set some I'm gonna set up. Look, the colors match. Here, can you set them both off at the same time? Here. Uh oh. oh. <laughs> Same time? Oh, that's right. Can you make both of those toys on the floor light up? <laughs> Alright, that's one. Can you do the cat ball? The ball that's next to it? What about the motion lights? Is anyone... Yeah, you guys can set yeah. them up. Go so these two are literally just motion lights. If someone goes by, these light up. Hmm. I Let's think... put one in the in this in this hallway. Yeah, I kinda wanna put over this there. though yeah. facing like this I'll area. This one over. You know, like if something comes walking through here. Yeah, yeah. We also could do everything that Patty and Mary have taught us. Mm -hmm. Should we? Should knock and introduce ourselves. Oh, yes. Yeah. And People say are, our names. We are, yeah, that's how you introduce yourself. You introduce yourself by saying your name? Hello, my name's Corey Shear. My name's Brandon. Elton. My name is Corbin Reinhardt. Well, if there's anyone here, we have a small amount of time to share with you tonight. <laughs> if you are a male, can you make these rods cross? If you are a female, make them go outwards. Was that it? Oh, that's just why as they can go. Okay. Um, could you please make these rods point to the direction where you are standing right now? No. Really? Ah! Dude, I'm not even close. I am... So it's a female, and she's, <laughs> she's right, right there. Right. Are you uncomfortable with us standing in front and behind you? Do you feel uncomfortable with us being here? Cross for yes, cross outwards for no. She's comfortable. Interesting. Is It could be. Any, I mean, there's, you know, two children, there's yeah. the wife, there's, there's the lady that got hung because she poisoned everybody. I know y'all heard that. What, what the f***? 
That's never happened. What just happened? Okay, so I walked in here because I heard like a pebble or something. Oh. The rim pod just broke. I mean the the, the, the dowsing the, rod. The dowsing rod just broke. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Dude, I stopped because did you break this? Oh wait, yeah, look. It's gone. That, that, no, that there, there's a black, that's what I heard fall. I heard something fall. That's why I stopped. What? Where did it go? Who was it that just broke that dowsing rod that I was holding? They might be shy. Was it Sarah? Or are you a little kid? If you want to play with us, you can touch any one of these devices to let us know that you're, you are here with us. Wait, you know what's really funny? We asked if it was scared of us and it said no and then broke our tool. <laughs> it was literally like, I'm not scared of you, but you're scared of me. Yeah, you remember she was saying it was a sassy person. Yeah. That had an attitude. Oh, oh look, no. Oh wait, I got a GoPro on it. What? Oh, literally when I just stopped he playing. Stopped playing. This whole time I've been playing, not one single thing. No. The cap on just went off? Yeah. This one, I've been playing this whole time. It hasn't done a single thing, and then I play the EOF away, and it goes off. The dowsing rod just broke. Dude, I know, I saw that. It's crazy. What is going on? You were just uh, making that, that was, we were trying to figure uh, Oh wait, that's not you. What? That's not him. What? No way. Where is it? Where is it? It's right there. I changed the direction it's facing. And it was going off? Yeah. Did okay. you stop following us? I got it, Jeremy. Go ahead. Go get B-roll. Go ahead. Go wander. <laughs> <laughs> I look. I literally rolled this around. I know. Nothing. I saw. I believe. And it went off when I stopped playing. Yeah. So I think it might have liked what you were probably doing. Probably wants us to keep playing. Yeah. So perhaps let's combine two things. Okay. We love being jolly and playing music. Yeah. And we know that Patty has told us that the vowel chants seem to work. Yes. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you can figure out how to play E O F O A. I can figure that out. And then you we can, can walk around this I place. I think it's that. All right. See. Oh, is that why it's. Box and the music hit. box went off at the same time. And the K2. Look. Look, look, what's going off? What Cat ball, happening? music box, and K2 just went off at the same time. Look at this, look at this, this is constant. It's gotten yellow. <sighs> oh! It's, look, it's right where the REM pod is. Someone's here. Can you touch the REM pod? What? 
That could be me. It could no, be. Yeah, it could be. It get could to be. the other opposite side with. Oh, yeah, that works. It's right where the red pots are going on. That's you. Are you here with us? Dude, that definitely did something. No, that definitely did something. This hasn't gone off the entire night. It's been by the piano. <sighs> Everything after you play. Uh -huh. Something happens after you play. Do you like the music? Do you want us to keep playing and singing? No! This just went off. Music box just went off. <laughs> you know where the K2's leading me? Where? The table where it happened. No, it's not. It just went off for it wants us to keep going. I think it, Evo Evo A was working. Yeah. I think so. We should go back to Dude, I picked up the cat ball. I rolled it around. It did not go off. So yeah, everybody I'm pick right. a room. Yeah. There's four of us. There's four room. rooms. Right, this, one, this is the one that I'll has go. been on the piano and is not going off. Like, na what? And it was just sitting right there two times. All different rooms. I'll yeah. go to the dining room. Yeah. You guys ready? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Dude, Dude when I asked him if it's ready, he just, or she, or he just said that they were ready. seen yet. Yeah. We know there's a lot of energy here. Yeah. And it seems to like us. So let's see if we can all bring it with us to push to the smallest part of the house. Yeah. And bring so everything it's concentrated in there. into a smaller area. Just invite everyone into one room together. We're taking all this energy that we have right now and putting it in the most haunted mirror. We're gonna ask all the spirits. Everyone, all the residents, capitals going on. Oh boy. To follow us. They might like it. Alright, let's Perfect. do it. And maybe because we've had every single device go off. Yeah. We've had Which every never, single never device happens. go off. Okay. So what happens wow. when we bring them all to one room yeah. with the spirit box and we have the new device that we got yesterday? Yeah. Let's see what happens. <laughs> See if there's anyone already with us. Let's go to the mirror. Out there. In, in the middle? Take a picture. I'm down. Take a picture in the mirror. I'm so oh. down. For all we know, we might already have a guest. Wait a second. Maybe there's if we have more than four people in that mirror, I'm gonna get freaked out. <laughs> you want me to take it? Sure. Cool. All right, you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna take a couple. Did you hear that behind us? Yeah. The footsteps. Corey, do it again. I'll turn my light off. Okay. Are people upstairs? You should look through them real quick and I'll go grab all the tools in the other room. Yeah. Okay. 
Can you see anything? I'll go grab the tools. Oh my god. Can you see <laughs> It sounded like a kid screaming. Whoa. What, did you find something? I... Whoa. What'd you find? This is kind of weird. What? Look at this. This is when I was taking pictures earlier. Look, okay. Mm -hmm. See that little blue dot right there? Yeah. Who? Who is oh, it? Awesome. Then look at that. Is that above it? What is that? Huh. These are in the top of the mirror. The top of the mirror? Like, up there. Huh. That's low key. Hmm. On like the 17th step. <sighs> low key. It actually is. Time to go to the room. Whose room is this? Do you know? Huh? Who's uh, room? Mrs. Sterling's day room. Oh, that was you. There's a little pot underneath. K2's going off. It's just going off? What to color is it on? Yellow. It's been kind of stuck in the Yellow? No, it's orange. There's like a constant energy that's filling this place. Well, I did say it's the same amount of energy that we had in the other part of the house. Yeah. Why is it so constant? Not too bad. Okay, let me go grab the other device, but just for the sake of time, if you guys want to keep starting, I'll go grab it. Right here. Yeah. Is there anyone here with us? Us. 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 How many of you are there? <laughs> This is Elton, this is Brandon, and I'm Corbin. Hey there. I love I love it. I love it. Did you like the music we were playing? I heard it. I heard it. Did you live here? Sounds like hello. Hey guys, what are you What is your name? What has happened here? Go run. Go run. Go run man. That was a clear go run. And that was a deep voice. Yeah. yeah. Is this where you slept? Unfortunately. How old are you? Boy, well, you heard 29. Huh? You heard 29. I heard 29. Is that what after that I heard 19? I didn't I didn't know exactly what it was. I heard Cory set here. That was a little kid. That was definitely a little kid. Will you visit us tonight? In our room? You say go! No footsteps though, just the door. Where? 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 Outside. I was in the kitchen. I wanted to go back with this in the in the dining hall. Just the door slams. No footsteps at all. Wait. No footsteps at all. Just the door closing. And I literally heard it as you guys were like outside. Some outside. That's the room we're sleeping in. 
Right there. Really? And we all know that spirits can easily go through walls. You know they can. <laughs> so perhaps we should yeah, go outside. Yeah, but Evan's the one that's sleeping there. We should we should all join them. Yeah. Make sure there's sure spirits there. there, and then, we'll and then let them go. Yeah. Right. Right. Birthday right. boys got to get. Make sure that it is that there's a butler there. Of course. Before he gets there. Right. Yeah. That'd be. We don't want to leave him unattended. We'd be terrible yeah. friends if we left him alone all night. Yeah. We need Evan daycare. You're yeah. not gonna leave me alone all night. I'll have the butler. That's the boy. Yeah. I'd go with the butler. Okay. I have this now. I have this now. Evan, you have that now. Oh. <laughs> Oh wow. That's your, that's your lovely room. Should we sing happy birthday as he opens it? <laughs> happy birthday to you. No, it's got this E-O-E-B-O-E. Oh, E-O-E-B-O day. E-O-E-B-O day. E-O-E-B-O day. E-O-E-B-O day. E-O-E-B-O day. E-O-E-B-O day. Saying that, so we'll go in there, and put a camera on, it, and then you'll lie to us Did and run out. Hear it? I'll be here, right here. Oh my God! Listen. You're gonna fart, aren't you? <laughs> I don't hear it, Corey. It literally stopped, dude. <laughs> <laughs> you called him out. You called him out. I'm being dead ass. It's not going off. Dude. It was going crazy. Every time you would start knocking, it would go to red. Episode. And then when you would stop, it would completely stop. Start knocking. You know, just for lying. I'm okay. not lying. <laughs> no one's going to believe me. I swear to God, it went to red like three times. So Ben's birthday. Ooh. So I feel like you should get the fun, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And then if anyone can't tell, but you can't. There's a new device right here that we got in our last video from Bloody Mary. Okay. Made by Paranologies. They actually have some really great stuff. So this thing oh, right here, yes, is basically a Ouija board, right? Okay. So you can see it. Yeah. Everything's on there. It's motorized and it spins. But the concept behind the guy that designed it is that the spirits are able to stop it on whatever letter they want, and then it'll start spinning the other way, and then they stop it, oh and then it keeps my spinning. God. And that's basically it. So we can ask questions, and then it can start answering. Wherever it stops, okay. on that orange light is what it's going to be. Joe, okay. Joe, can you actually see that on your screen, like what that looks like, those letters? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, totally. Cool. So we can see, see that for Yeah, exactly. So viewers, Whoa. you're going to... What was that? See that? What the heck was that? There's a big flashing light out there. Look, it's this. Oh. oh, it is this. Yeah, that's, that's what it is. Wait, no, but it did it out here first. Wait, oh, wait. Saw it again? Yeah, yeah it's, it's, this. The yeah, it's this. Look, it's box. Is it really? Yeah. yeah, it lights up the letters. Oh, that is sick. That is very cool. So what I think we're going to do, it's crazy, it's still there, is we're all just going to sit around it, eyes closed, Oh wow. and just let the viewers be able to figure out what it is. Ooh. So it's all set on the floor here. Okay. Down. That's not the floor. Yeah, well here not. The and then they're all sit don't sit right in front of Jenna. No way. No way. way. No what? way. What? What did you see? I just saw a person standing behind Jenna. Wait, 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 what are you talking about? I was like hoping that there was just like a super tall like Maybe like coat rack or what something. Did, what did you put it? Stop. Where did you see it? It was like up to here. Oh my god. And it was like a head, 
and then it was like, like just like a big bump. <clears throat> cool, have a good night, guys. <laughs> Dude, I swear, I just saw that. <laughs> Wait, so you're telling me that like, then we should definitely get activity. Could be the butler. <gasps> oh yeah, the butler. Mm -hmm. Okay. This would be the butler. This is the first one we've ever used a device. Perhaps you guys can help us figure out how it works. Yeah, let's, let's fill the circle up right now. Do you imagine somebody walking in here? Can I serve you? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Alright, so I'm going to restart it. And then perhaps we'll put the, the birthday boy ask a question. Perfect. Eyes closed, everyone. Eyes closed. My finger is on the machine. The machine has restarted. Alright. Let's introduce ourselves. Yeah. Hello, spirits. My name's Evan, and we have with us Brandon, Elton, Corey, and Corbin Reinhardt. <laughs> uh, we'd like to invite you to communicate with us and uh, you know answer some questions. And we encourage interactions with us, whether that's knocking, touching, or interacting with this device in front of us. Uh, so. Who do we have the pleasure of speaking with tonight? Does anybody feel like the room got a little bit colder? I actually want to put out some cat balls. Let's go for it. Yeah. You want to wait? Should we wait, Brian? Sure. Yeah, I think we should. How do we turn this off? I feel like we got to restart it because it's still with the letters on it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think that. Because it's glowing in the dark as soon as it lights up on that letter, it kind of stays until oh, the glow fades dark. away. Yeah. yeah. All right, spirits, whom we have the pleasure of speaking with today. If the cat ball does go off, you should let us know. Okay. Uh, I haven't seen a flash. You can talk to us through Knox as well. Cat balls going off. Oh my god, it is. <sighs> okay. Oh. First off, Corey, why did you have your eyes open? <laughs> I, I, I keep up with that. <laughs> but thank you. If there are any spirits or souls in this house or in this room with us, could you please try spelling out your name on this new device that we have? watching to see if this is going to flash again yeah. and literally out of the corner of my eye right between us I saw something just come right down. Chloe? Like a, like a pillar or like a... No, I don't know. It was just... Like a figure. Uh, yeah, it, it, but it was, it was so fast. Is there anyone or anything in this room with us? But maybe it's like our room pod where seems to be working a lot now, but when we first got it, it was a shimmer. You yeah. picked it up though, it worked so well when yeah. we were walking around. And yeah, you got like a couple flashes. Yeah, that was kind of weird. It was also, you went to the next room. Another idea is, what if we put a camera on it, and just set it over there, and then if we see the flash, the camera will pick up the did light. Did you hear that Yeah. You did? Because all I'm saying is that one door's low and one creaked open now in the closet, and that's where that creep just came from. Oh, cool, it's behind me. <laughs> Dude, you know what's going crazy? Oh, wait, did it? Oh. What is going H? on? H. Q. What? K. What? Dude, it was all happening when you were there before, too. H, Q, K. H, Q, K. Those are your initials? Best if you walk with it. J L. J L. Wait. Oh, my Those, that's Jonah's own initials. Oh, uh, yeah. J L. Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do you do? You gotta 
walk around with it. Or maybe it wants you to walk around with it. Yeah. Oh, touch. H again. I. Hi. 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 Hello. Hi. Hello. I'm gonna put that in the other room with all of us, except for Evan. You know? Evan let's, leave Evan, let's leave Evan in here. With, with this thing? That was Evan. No, we'll bring idea. this with us. Maybe we ask questions to that and also to Evan at the same time. Was that your idea? Oh, okay. Spirit box headphones? Oh, okay. Is there too many people in this room? Do you remember, do you remember the last time you put the spirit box headphones on? Uh huh. That was cool. Oh, yeah, that was in uh, 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 Ohio State. No, West, right. West Virginia Penn. West Virginia, Virginia Penn, yeah. If you are a boy, can you, you say first? yes? Want to do first, Jack? Yeah, Michael? No, 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 I can't see the. It's okay. Oh, you already find out. Cameras will see it. Yeah, cameras will see it. Take a little photo. Cameras will see it. There you go. Yeah. What was the one thing you told me you didn't want to do on your birthday? Are you a girl? That's exactly what I told you I didn't want to do. <laughs> <laughs> no. Why? Oh, I'm following up. That's what's happening. 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 Oh! It's so loud. Okay. Maybe slightly quieter, just so that way I'm not yelling. How that hurts. Happy birthday. <laughs> uh, I'm such a great friend. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I don't want my birthday to happen. <laughs> you look like an alien. It was like an anime character. Alright, let's go to the next room with advice and ask questions. Is there any spirits or souls here that would like to communicate with us? Or is there a butler here that would also like to talk with us? Still here? No! <gasps> no way. Are you in this room? Where are you? You might be able to see us, but we cannot see you right now. Dreaming. This person. Wait, are they saying that Evan's dreaming? This person dreaming. This I'm per with you. <gasps> you say I'm with you? Yeah. This person's dreaming I'm with you. Are you referring to our friend on the bed? That's laying down with his eyes closed? His name's Evan. And it's his birthday. If you want to wish Evan a happy birthday. Bold. That's right. Twenty. Twenty. Uh, Are you twenty? That's not that old. Twenty's still pretty young. Guilty. Do you feel guilty of something? Did you do something? Something bad? Off limits. Wait, did you just see that flash? Yeah, outside? what was that flash? How did it come Some out? sort of loud scream. Whoa. A loud scream. Dude. There's something flashing outside. Is it over here? Dude, there's nothing. Did you get the flash on camera? I don't think so. It's over here, it's flashing! It's over here! It's, it's over here! The toy. What color is it? Wait, get it? I just saw it outside. I just saw it outside. Sorry we walked away from you. Are you Charlie. still here? Charlie. Charlie? Charlie? Did you say Charlie? Shit out of them. And then it was 
thing I've ever done. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait,